Get your dream job with Chennai Race Institute. P and Q together can do a piece of work in 6 2 by 3 days. P is thrice as efficient as R. S is twice as efficient as R. P alone can do the same work in 10 days. If P, Q, R and S start working together and after 2 days R leaves and S leaves 2 days before the completion of work. Then how many days will it require to complete the whole work? The options are A. 4 11 by 13 B. 3 12 by 17 C. 4 12 by 13 D. 6 11 by 13 E. 7 12 by 13 Let's see the solution. P alone can do the work in 10 days. It means P completes 1 by 10 work for a day. In the question they given, P and Q together can complete same work in 6 2 by 3 days. We can write 6 2 by 3 as 20 by 3 days. P and Q can complete the work one day is 1 divided by 20 by 3 equal to 3 by 20. P's one day work plus Q's one day work is equal to 3 by 20. We know P's one day work is 1 by 10 plus Q's one day work is equal to 3 by 20. From this, Q's one day work is equal to 1 by 20. In the question, they also given that P is thrice as efficient as R. It means R takes three times more days compared to P. Here, P alone takes 10 days to complete the work. So, R alone takes 30 days to complete the work. And R's one day work is 1 by 30. Next statement is, S is twice as efficient as R. It means S works two times faster compared to R. Here, R alone takes 30 days to complete the work. So, S alone takes 15 days to complete the work. And S one day work is 1 by 15. Now, P, Q, R and S started a work together. Let's assume work completed in X days. P works for X days, so X by 10 plus. Q also works for X days, so X by 20 plus. After 2 days, R leaves the work. So, R works for 2 days only, so 2 by 30 plus. And S leaves 2 days before the completion of work. So, X minus 2 divided by 15 is equal to 1. From this, 6x plus 3x plus 4 plus 4x minus 8 by 60 is equal to 1. After solving this, we get x is equal to 4 12 by 13 days. So, the answer is option C, 4 12 by 13.